टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न सम थियरम्स ऑन सीरीज ऑफ नॉन निगेटिव नंबर्स नॉन निगेटिव नंबर्स थियरम नंबर थ्री थियरम नंबर थ्री द हार्मोनिक सीरीज इज डाइवर्जेंट सीरीज द हार्मोनिक सीरीज हार्मोनिक सीरीज सिग्मा एन इज इक्वल टू वन टू इन्फिनिटी वन अपॉन एन इज डाइवर्जेंट इज डाइवर्जेंट प्रूफ ऑफ दिस थियरम थ्री प्रूफ ऑफ द थियरम थ्री We have sigma one upon n, which is equal to one plus one upon two plus one upon three plus and so on plus one upon n plus one upon n plus one plus and so on. We have the series. We have the harmonic series. Harmonic. सीरीज समीशन वन बाय एन एन इज इक्वल टू वन टू इन्फिनिटी इज इक्वल टू वन अपॉन वन प्लस वन अपॉन टू प्लस वन अपॉन थ्री प्लस एंड सो ऑन प्लस वन बाय एन प्लस वन बाय एन प्लस वन प्लस एंड सो ऑन लेट यस एन Let s suffix n is equal to is equal to nth partial sum of given series sigma one upon n. That is, s n is equal to one plus half plus one upon three plus and so on plus one upon n for each n belongs to I. One by two plus one by three. Plus and so on. Plus one by n for all n belongs to I. For every positive integer n. For every positive integer n. Sum of first ter n terms of the given series, harmo given harmonic series. <laughs> Here s one, s one is equal to sum of first term that is one. That is one. This one can be written as two plus zero upon two. This yes one, yes one is yes suffix two raised to zero is one, and which is equal to yes one is equal to two plus zero by two, two plus zero by two. Yes suffix. Two raised to zero. <coughs> yes two. Yes two is equal to sum of first two term. That is one plus half, which is equal to one plus half is equal to three by two. Addition of these two number is equal to three by two. Three by two can be written as two plus one upon two. This yes suffix two is yes suffix two raised to one is equal to two plus one upon two. Two plus one upon two. Similarly, yes suffix four. Similarly, we write yes suffix four. Yes suffix four is sum of first four terms of the series. One plus one by two plus one by three plus one by four, which is equal to yes two plus one by yes two plus one by three plus one by four, one by three plus one by four. That is three by two plus. Plus one upon three 
प्लस वन बाय फोर बट थ्री इज लेस देन फोर बट थ्री इज लेस देन फोर देर फोर वन अपॉन थ्री इज ग्रेटर देन वन बाय फोर देर फोर यस फोर यस सफिक्स फोर इज इक्वल टू थ्री बाय थ्री बाय टू प्लस वन बाय थ्री प्लस वन बाय फोर इज ग्रेटर देन और इक्वल टू थ्री बाय टू प्लस वन बाय फोर प्लस वन बाय फोर दिस वन अपॉन थ्री इज रिप्लेस्ड बाय वन बाय फोर देर फोर वी राइट यस फोर इज ग्रेटर देन और इक्वल टू यस फोर कैन बी रिटर्न एज यस सफिक्स टू रेस टू टू यस सफिक्स टू रेस टू टू Which is equal to three by two plus two by four, which is equal to half. Three by two plus two by four, two by four, ah, two by four, which is equal to three by two plus half. Four by two, which is equal to two plus two by two. Yes, suffix two raised to two. Yes, suffix two raised to two is equal to two plus two by two. This is a relation one. This is a relation two. This is a relation three. We write. Similarly, we write. Similarly, we write. Yes, suffix eight. Yes, suffix eight is equal to one plus one by two plus one by three plus one by four plus one by five plus one by six plus one by seven plus one by eight one by eight. Sum of first four term is yes four. And S four is equal to two actually. Yes suffix eight. Yes suffix eight is equal to yes suffix four plus one by five plus one by six plus one by seven plus one by eight. Clearly five is less than eight. Therefore one upon five is Clearly, five is less than eight. Therefore, one by five is greater than one by eight. Six is less than eight. Therefore, one by six is greater than one by eight. Seven is less than eight. Therefore, one by seven is also greater than one by eight. Writing the value of yes four and replacing one upon five, one upon six, one upon seven is greater than one by eight, one by eight, and one by eight. We obtain yes suffix eight is greater than or equal to two plus two plus one by eight. Two is the value of yes four. Yes, suffix four is two plus two upon four, which is four by two is equal to two. Two plus one by eight plus one by eight plus one by eight plus one by eight. That is four by eight. Two plus four by eight, which is equal to two plus one by two, which is equal to. Five by two, and this is equal to two plus three upon two. Yes, suffix eight is greater than yes suffix eight. That is yes suffix two to the power three. Two to the power three is eight. Two raised to three is eight. Yes suffix two raised to three is greater than or equal to. Two plus three by two. Two plus three by two, and so on. In general, we write yes suffix two raised to 
n. This is the equation 4. From 1, 2, 3 and 4 and so on. In general, in general we write we write s yes, suffix 2 rest to n is greater than or equal to 2 plus n by 2. 2 plus n by 2. And so on. And so on. Now limit n tends to infinity of. Now limit n tends to infinity of s yes, suffix 2 rest to n is equal is greater than or equal to limit n tends to infinity of n tends to infinity of 2 plus n by 2 which is equal to infinity infinity therefore the subsequence yes suffix 2 rest to n diverges to infinity therefore the subsequence the subsequence S yes, suffix 2 rest to n, n is equal to 1 to infinity, not 1 to infinity, 0 to infinity, diverges to, diverges to infinity, diverges to infinity. S yes, suffix 2 rest to n is subsequence of Sn. S yes, suffix Therefore, s yes, suffix 2 rest to n, n is equal to 0 to infinity, is subsequence of Sn. n is equal to 1 to infinity. Therefore, sequence Sn, n is equal to 1 to infinity, diverges to infinity. Therefore, the sequence the sequence s yes, suffix n, n is equal to 1 to infinity, diverges to infinity. By definition of convergence and divergence of series, corresponding series, corresponding harmonic series, sigma 1 upon n is divergent or it diverges to infinity. Therefore, by definition of divergence series, by definition of divergence of series, series, sigma 1 upon n, n is equal to 1 to infinity, harmonic series, sigma 1 upon n diverges to infinity, diverges to infinity. Hence the, hence the proof of the proof of theorem. Hence the proof of the theorem number 3. Theorem number 4. Theorem number 4. Statement of theorem number 4. Theorem number 4. If sigma an is a divergent series of positive number, if sigma an, n is equal to 1 to infinity, is a divergent series, is a divergent divergent series divergent series of positive numbers positive numbers divergent series of positive numbers then there is a sequence then there is, there is a sequence 
when there is a sequence epsilon suffix yan epsilon suffix yan yan is equal to 1 to infinity of positive numbers of positive numbers epsilon n n is equal to 1 to infinity sequence of positive numbers which converges to 0 which converges to 0 which converges to 0 but for which but for which summation epsilon n into a n n is equal to 1 to infinity still diverges still diverges summation epsilon n into a n still diverges this is the statement of the theorem number 4 proof proof of this theorem since by hypothesis sigma a n n is equal to 1 to infinity is divergent series of positive numbers divergent series of positive numbers <coughs> let s n is equal to s suffix n is equal to a1 plus a2 plus a3 plus and so on plus an for every n belongs to i sn is nth partial sum of divergent series sigma an n is equal to 1 to infinity sum of first n numbers therefore sk we write s suffix k sum of first k terms of the series s suffix k is equal to is equal to a1 plus a2 plus a3 plus and so on plus a suffix k for every k belongs to i k is positive integer in short we write summation summation r is equal to 1 to k a suffix r s suffix k plus 1 a suffix s suffix k plus 1 is equal to a1 plus a2 plus a3 plus and so on plus a suffix k plus a suffix k plus 1 for every k belongs to i for every positive integer k. Now, s k plus 1 minus s k. Now, s suffix k plus 1 minus s k is equal to a1 minus a1, a2 minus a2, a3 minus a3, a k minus a k cancels a suffix k plus 1. a suffix k plus 1. For every k belongs to i for positive integer k. For every k belongs to i. Since by hypothesis sigma a n is series of positive numbers. Series of positive numbers. Since by hypothesis sigma a n n is equal to 1 to infinity is series of positive number series of positive positive numbers positive numbers therefore a n is greater than or equal to 0 for every n belongs to i. 
इट मीन्स ए वन इज ग्रेटर दैन और इक्वल टू जीरो ए टू इज ग्रेटर दैन और इक्वल टू जीरो ए थ्री इज ग्रेटर दैन और इक्वल टू जीरो ए के इज ग्रेटर दैन और इक्वल टू जीरो ए के प्लस वन इज ऑल्सो ग्रेटर दैन और इक्वल टू जीरो एंड सो ऑन ए के प्लस वन इज ऑल्सो ग्रेटर दैन और इक्वल टू जीरो ए सफिक्स के प्लस वन इज ऑल्सो ग्रेटर दैन और इक्वल टू जीरो फॉर एवरी के बिलोंग्स टू आई therefore yes suffix k plus 1 minus sk is equal to ak plus 1 is greater than or equal to 0 for all k belongs to i therefore yes suffix k plus 1 minus sk is equal to ak plus 1 a k plus one is greater than or equal to zero for every k belongs to i. That is, s k plus one minus s k is non-negative for every k belongs to i. s k plus one is greater than or equal to s k for all k belongs to i. That is. That is, yes suffix k is less than or equal to yes suffix k plus one. For every k belongs to I. For every positive integer k. That is, <coughs> yes one is less than or equal to yes two. Yes one is less than or equal to yes two. Yes two is less than or equal to yes three. Yes three is less than or equal to and so on. Yes k is Less than or equal to s k plus one. Less than or equal to and so on. Therefore, sequence s suffix k k is equal to one to infinity is non-decreasing sequence of real numbers. Sequence s suffix k k is equal to one to infinity is non decreasing non decreasing sequence non decreasing sequence of real numbers non decreasing sequence of real numbers <coughs> S k k is equal to one to infinity is non-decreasing sequence of real numbers. Real numbers. Now we consider the series sigma k is equal to one to infinity s k plus one minus s k upon s k plus one. This uh, series sigma a n n is equal to one to infinity is divergent series of real number. Since by hypothesis, since by hypothesis sigma a n n is equal to one to infinity is divergent series of series of positive numbers positive numbers therefore sequence of partial sum by definition by definition of divergent series sigma an diverges therefore sequence sk diverges therefore sequence s suffix k k is equal to 1 to infinity is divergent divergent series therefore by definition of sequence diverges to infinity limit k tends to infinity of s k is equal to infinity limit k tends to infinity of s suffix k is equal to infinity infinity limit n tends to infinity of s n is equal to infinity 
Since this series, sigma a n is divergent series, therefore corresponding sequence of partial sum is also divergent series. Therefore, for any for any n belongs to I, we can find m belongs to I such that s suffix n plus 1 is is greater than 2 times s suffix m. Since this sequence is divergent sequence of real numbers, therefore for any n belongs to i, we can find m belongs to i such that Sn plus 1 is greater than or equal to 2 times Sm. Hmm? Since this series is divergent se series, therefore corresponding sequence is also divergent sequence. Therefore, for any n belongs to I, therefore for any n belongs to I, we can find m belongs to i such that such that sn plus 1 is s suffix n plus 1 is greater than or equal to 2 times sm 2 times Sm. Therefore, 1 upon Sn plus 1 is less than 1 over Sn plus 1 is less than or equal to 1 upon 2 times S suffix M. Multiplying by Sm, Sm, S suffix M upon S suffix N is less than or equal to 1 by 2. Multiplying by minus 1. Multiplying by minus 1. We obtain. We obtain. Here is. S suffix. M upon S. S suffix. N plus 1. Multiplying by minus 1. We obtain minus SM. Upon. S yes, suffix n plus 1 is greater than or equal to minus 1 half. Minus 1 half. Adding 1, we obtain 1 minus 1 minus Sm upon Sn plus 1 is greater than or equal to 1 minus half, which is equal to 1 half. That is, that is, 1 minus Sm upon Sn plus 1 is greater than or equal to 1 by 2. This is say result number 1. Result number 1. <laughs> Consider this series. Now, consider this series. Consider the series. Summation k is equal to 1 to infinity. S yes, suffix k plus 1 minus sk upon sk plus 1. Consider the series. Summation k is equal to 1 to infinity. Sk plus 1 minus Sk upon Sk plus 1. That is, summation k is equal to 1 to infinity. Ak plus 1 upon Sk plus 1. Ak plus 1. Let, let Tn is equal to Tn is nth partial sum of this series. Let Tn, T suffix n is equal to summation 
k is equal to 1 to n sum of first n terms of the series s suffix k plus 1 minus s suffix k upon s k plus 1 upon s suffix k plus 1 <coughs> therefore t suffix m minus 1 t suffix m minus 1 is equal to summation k is equal to 1 to m minus 1 s suffix k plus 1 minus s k upon s k plus 1 tn is partial sum of the series summation k is equal to 1 to infinity s k plus 1 minus s k upon s k plus 1 Tn is nth partial sum of this series. Now if n is greater than m, n is greater than m. Now if small n is greater than m, greater than m, then mod of Tn minus Tm minus 1. Now, modulus of T suffix N minus T suffix M minus 1 is equal to, is equal to summation, is equal to summation K is equal to 1 to N, SK plus 1 minus SK upon SK plus 1 minus summation k is equal to 1 to m minus 1 sk plus 1 minus sk upon sk plus 1 summation summation k is equal to 1 to n sk plus 1 minus sk upon s k plus 1 minus sigma k is equal to 1 to m minus 1 s k plus 1 minus s k upon s k plus 1 here m n is greater than m and s k plus 1 minus s k is a k plus 1 which is positive and s k plus 1 is also sum of k plus 1 positive numbers therefore s k plus 1 is also positive therefore modulus of these terms are equal to equal to a k plus 1 upon s k plus 1 addition of these two numbers is equal to summation k is equal to m 2 m 2 n s k plus 1 minus s k upon s k plus 1 modulus of t n minus t n t m minus 1 is equal to s k plus 1 minus s k upon s k plus 1 this is the value of modulus of t n minus t m minus 1 this is say result number 2 result number 2 since by hypothesis since by hypothesis <coughs> since by hypothesis sigma a n is series of divergent series of real numbers and s k sequence s k k is equal to 1 to infinity is sequence of non decreasing sequence of real numbers since sequence s suffix k k is equal to 1 to infinity is 
non decreasing non decreasing sequence non decreasing sequence of real numbers a real numbers therefore s1 less than or equal to s2 s2 less than or equal to s3 less than or equal to and so on sk less than or equal to sk plus 1 less than or equal to and so on sn is less than or equal to sn plus 1 less than or equal to and so on sequence is non decreasing sequence non decreasing sequence s suffix n plus 1 less than or equal to and so on and so on that is sk is less than or equal to sn sk is less than or equal to sn for every n greater than or equal to k since here suffix is s1 s2 s3 this suffix increases the value of the term of this sequence also increases that is for all n greater than or equal to k for every small n greater than or equal to k s k plus 1 yes suffix k plus 1 is also less than or equal to s yes suffix n plus 1 for every n is greater than or equal to k for every positive integer n greater than or equal to k therefore one upon sk plus 1 one upon sk plus 1 is greater than or equal to sk plus 1 is greater than or equal to one upon sn plus 1 for every n greater than or equal to k this is say 3 3 using 3 in 2 or it is up to using 3 in r h s of 2 r h s of 2 we obtain modulus of tn minus tm minus 1 is equal to summation k is equal to 1 m2 tn sk plus 1 minus sk upon sk plus 1 this 1 upon sk plus 1 is greater than or equal to greater than or equal to summation k is equal to m to n sk plus 1 minus sk upon sn plus 1 sn plus 1 1 upon sk plus 1 is greater than or equal to 1 upon sn plus 1 therefore modulus of tn minus tm minus 1 is greater than or equal to equal to 1 upon sn plus 1 times sigma k is equal to m to n sk plus 1 minus sk modulus of tn minus tm Minus one is greater than or equal to one upon summation is with respect to k one upon s n plus one into summation 
के इज इक्वल टू यम टू यम टू यन यस के प्लस वन यस सफिक्स के प्लस वन माइनस यस के माइनस यस सफिक्स के विच इज ग्रेटर देन और इक्वल टू मॉड्यूलस ऑफ टी एन माइनस मॉड्यूलस ऑफ टी एन माइनस टी एम माइनस वन इज ग्रेटर देन और इक्वल टू वन अपॉन यस एन प्लस वन एंड इन टू करली ब्रैकेट वी राइट के इज इक्वल टू यम के इज इक्वल टू यम के इज इक्वल टू यम वी ऑप्टेन यस सफिक्स यम प्लस वन माइनस यस एम यस सफिक्स यम प्लस वन माइनस यस एम प्लस के इज इक्वल टू यम प्लस वन यम प्लस वन प्लस वन दट इज यस यम प्लस टू माइनस यस यम प्लस वन यस यम प्लस वन प्लस यस यम प्लस थ्री माइनस यस यम प्लस टू प्लस एंड सो ऑन लास्ट टर्म इज यस सफिक्स यन प्लस वन माइनस यस एन करली ब्रैकेट कंप्लीट करली ब्रैकेट कंप्लीट यस सफिक्स यम प्लस वन डिस्टर्ब विल कैंसल विथ माइनस एस एम प्लस वन यस यम प्लस टू डिस्टर्ब विल कैंसल विथ माइनस यस यम प्लस टू यस यम प्लस थ्री कैंसल विथ माइनस एस एम प्लस थ्री मीन्स दिस यस सफिक्स माइनस यन कैंसल विथ प्लस यस सफिक्स एन मॉड्यूलो सॉफ टी एन माइनस टी एम माइनस वन इज ग्रेटर देन और इक्वल टू वन अपॉन यस एन प्लस वन इन टू ब्रैकेट यस सफिक्स एन प्लस वन माइनस यस एम माइनस एस एम and this is equal to 1 minus sm upon sn plus 1 therefore we write modulus of tn minus tm minus 1 is greater than or equal to sn plus 1 upon sn plus 1 becomes 1 minus sm upon sn plus 1 sm upon sn plus 1 and this bracket is greater than half by 1 this is this bracket is greater than or equal to 1 half by 1 by relation 1 therefore modulus of tn minus tm minus 1 is greater than or equal to 1/2 half. 1/2 half. for every n m greater than or equal to capital n therefore therefore mod of tn minus tm minus 1 is not less than 1/2 For all m n greater than or equal to capital n. Therefore, this sequence t n n is equal to one to infinity is not a Cauchy sequence. Therefore, sequence t suffix n n is equal to one to infinity is not a. Cauchy's sequence. Therefore, sequence T n n is equal to one to infinity is not convergent. Therefore, the sequence. Therefore, sequence T n. Sequence T suffix T n n is equal to one to infinity is. Not convergent. 
is not convergent. He is not convergent. That is sequenced yan. T suffix yan, yan is equal to 1 to infinity is divergent. Divergent. Therefore, by definition of divergent series, corresponding series, summation k is equal to 1 to infinity s k plus 1 minus s k upon s k plus 1 is divergent. By definition of divergent series, by definition of divergent series summation k is equal to 1 to infinity s k plus 1 minus s k upon s k plus 1 is divergent is divergent but s k plus 1 minus s k is equal to a k plus 1. But s k plus 1 minus s k is equal to a k plus 1. Therefore, we write summation k is equal to 1 to infinity s k plus 1 minus s k this series s k plus 1 minus s k upon s k plus 1 is equal to sigma k is equal to 1 to infinity a k plus 1 upon s k plus 1 is equal to summation k is equal to 2 to infinity a k upon s k. K is equal to 2. We obtain first term. A 2 upon s 2. Here k is equal to 1. We obtain a 2. A suffix 1 plus 1 is a 2. And s suffix 1 plus 1 is s 2. T is divergent series. T is divergent. Divergent. Let epsilon k epsilon k is equal to 1 upon s k 1 upon s k limit n tends to infinity of epsilon n or limit k tends to infinity limit k tends to infinity of epsilon k is equal to limit k tends to infinity of RHS that is 1 upon SK. Limit k tends to infinity of SK is equal to infinity and 1 upon infinity is equal to 0. Since sigma an is divergent series of positive number and Sn is partial sum of sigma an therefore Sequence as n, n is equal to 1 to infinity is divergent. That is s k, k is equal to k tends to infinity, s k is equal to infinity, 1 upon infinity becomes 0. Therefore, this sequence epsilon k converges to 0. Epsilon k converges to 0. Therefore, we write sigma k is equal to 2 to infinity epsilon k into a k epsilon k into a k is divergent divergent series 1 upon s k is equal to s epsilon k k is equal to 2 to infinity by adding two terms that is epsilon 1 a k we see that this series summation k is equal to 1 to infinity epsilon k into a k is still divergent by adding by adding one term epsilon 1 into a1 
by adding epsilon 1 into a1 we see that the series summation k is equal to 1 to infinity epsilon k into a k still diverges still diverges hence the proof of the theorem hence the proof of the theorem hence the proof of the theorem thank you for watching the video